Hi everyone. In this video I'm going to be reviewing Hippo water slide paper and I would just like to first say thank you to Hippo for including me and trusting me to review their product. I know that they chose other creators as well so I just want to say thank you for being included in that group. I will not be doing a detailed tutorial on this particular cup in this video but that will be upcoming soon. Some tips that I have when working with clear water slide paper. You want to make sure first and foremost that you seal, seal, seal very well. Um, I used triple thick to seal mine so I sealed them twice and I didn't have any issues. If I was using Rust-Oleum, I would seal them three to four times. You want to make sure that you seal them really well. You want to make sure that you have an epoxy layer down before you apply them to your cup. If you have to sand your epoxy, you want to make sure that you put another layer of epoxy down over that before applying your water slides. If not, any dull spots or scratch marks that are caused by the sanding could show through the clear parts of the water slide. You also want to make sure that your printer settings are set to high or best quality, whatever your printer says. You want to make sure that it's set to the best setting. The water slide was really easy to apply. I didn't try the reverse method with this paper. Um, but I know a lot of people have trouble doing it this way. So that's why I decided to do it this way. And I debated between doing a full wrap or the smaller images. And I know that a lot of people don't have a lot of luck with full wrap water slides. I think most people use them in this way anyway for the smaller images so that's why I chose to do it this way as well just so that you could see how easy they were to work with when I sealed them I sealed once up and down I let it sit for about 10 to 15 minutes then did side to side and let them sit overnight just because it was already late um, after I got them on the cup Again, I let them sit overnight because it was already late and came back and put the epoxy on and they're perfect. I can't see any outlines. Um, they're perfect. The color, the color is spot on. So no issues, no stretching, no tearing, no ink, uh, bleed. So I highly recommend the product um, and the company is offering a discount code to all of my viewers. It will be in the description. The code is for 30% off. And then when you get to the Amazon page, there is also an additional 10% off coupon that you can click on so you'll be getting 40% off and I think the Amazon price is $13.99. It is only available for inkjet printers right now at the moment, but I mean 40% off of $13.99. If you have an inkjet printer, I highly recommend that you give this product a try. Again, I will be doing a more detailed tutorial on this cup. I had a lot of fun making this cup, but there are a couple of changes that I want to make on the next one. But there you go. So yeah, go, go check out the paper, use the code. Thank you for watching everyone. Bye.